Lighthearted. Off beat. Of stories that are not necessarily the news. Got some information taking you way back right about now. To, to 1950s. The 1950s, that's right. Oh my goodness. And uh, it tells you pretty much this list how to get a, a man. Guy. Yeah. 129 ways? Yeah. A whole 129 ways so, to get a man. So, ladies, make sure you turn up your radios because uh, this is information that you may want to know. I don't know. It's kind of different now compared to 1958. Of course, of course. Very of course. different. So, get this right. They tell you the huge list is split into sections, all right? Like I said before, 1950s. Very detailed set of instructions explain how to get a man, hook him, and keep him. Mm. Yeah, all right then. So this was written up in a magazine. They tell you where to find him, where to find him. Get this, all right? If you stumble, stumble when you walk into a room, the same room that he's in. You will get attention. It's true though. That would work. If, if a lady walks into a room and she trips or whatever. To get your attention. I'm not going to fall on my face to get your attention, buddy. Guys would pay attention. Guys would help. If you can't smell me and look at me when I walk in the room, I'm not even going to pretend to fall down. <laughs> you understand me? Good. Forget what? Discretion. Every once in a while, call him up. Mm hmm. Carry your hat box. Yeah. Remember, of course, this is 1950s. Go on. A hat box? Mm -hmm. a, what does a hat box look like? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> a box where you put your hat in. I don't know. Wear a band aid. Yeah. Pe people always ask. What happened? This is true, though. Make it's a true. lot of money so that you don't need no man to come and confuse you. Well, let's not add it. I just added that part. Just yeah, that's not on the script here, Michelle. <laughs> that's not on the script. Okay. Wow. <laughs> learn several funny stories and learn how to tell them well. But make sure you don't tell him them, tell him all at once. Uh, but I think you should be a naturalist, so... Okay, all right. Fair okay. enough. What about this one? Right? Walk up to him and tell him you need some advice. That would work. That would work. That would get a guy's attention. No doubt about that. Drop the handkerchief. Mm, people still walk with a handkerchief. Though. I think it's yeah. I, I, I like it. Yeah? Yeah. My really? grandmother used to always carry a handkerchief. Hmm. Yeah. Um, have your father buy some theater tickets that need to be that need to be got rid of. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. All right, <laughs> okay. next. Okay, what is it? Stand in the corner and cry softly. How pathetic is this? Yeah, that's a bit pathetic, but uh, but it is effective. Chris, it is effective. Because when you see a woman crying in the corner, you going to approach her? Any guy would and ask what happened. Really? She got issues on subscription. Just keep walking, eh? I can tell you this right now, eh? If I in a corner Michigan crying... you got problems, boy. <laughs> <laughs> You're so bitter. I'm Gosh. Just <laughs> okay, whatever. All right. Buy a convertible. Men like to write them. Mm. Buy a book convertible and write in it, okay? All right, then. If you're at a resort, have a bellboy page you. Back in 1958. Okay, mm. another one. I guess that would show you, you know, you're in charge and you're... Huh. All right, whatever. Okay, what about this? Don't let him fish for your name next time you meet. You mean you can't remember my name? Yeah, well, that's, that's an issue. What about this one? Learn how to bake tasty apple pies. Well, you know, they say the way to a, a man's heart is through his stomach. So I can see how that one would still work today. And uh, that one is one that would always live on. And bring it in the office. You know what I say to that one? You have hands, you can bake your own pie. All right? Wow. I'm just saying. Um, laugh at his jokes. Listen, I'm a horrible liar. If your jokes are dry, I'm just going to stare at you with that look in my face like, you know what? Next. I'm so done. I'm so done. But anyway. So you don't think any of these things, Mishka, could work in think, today's world? I think all of these things tend to kind of defeminize women to an extent. I could be very wrong. I'm just saying, right? Okay. I just feel that way. I'm not a stumbling in 